Hey, Mike Brooks here from Nuclear Chowder Marketing. And you're probably wondering why I'm standing here wearing a cape. Well, I was on the Superheroes of Marketing podcast with Elisa Meredith and Kelly Kranz back in August. And, well, they sent me this cool cape. So, hey, if you've got a cape, I think you should wear a cape. And uh, the Superman shirt is just because, well, I'm wearing a cape. So, I mean, naturally, I should wear the Superman shirt. Anyway... There's another reason why I'm wearing this. See, today I'm going to show you really quickly how to create a Pinterest image using Canva.com. Now, Canva.com is a free tool for you, and it makes it super easy to create really cool Pinterest images. And I'm going to use this cape here to uh, a picture with me in this cape to uh, create a Pinterest image as an example. So I hope you enjoy this. Pinterest is a really, really powerful social media platform. Images are huge on social media and on the internet in general. They always have been and they always will be. And you should definitely be checking out Pinterest to drive traffic to your website. We'll talk a lot about that coming up in episodes in the future. But uh, right now I'm going to fly away and show you how to use Canva to create a Pinterest image and you'll do it in a flash. Welcome to this video. We're going to do a very quick, quick Pinterest design here in Canva. Lots of tools you can use, lots of apps and tools you can use on your desktop, but we're going to talk Canva today. Uh, one of my favorites, very, very easy to use and create things very fast. It's canva.com and you can see here you're going to be greeted with some templates that you can go ahead and launch and just start editing things. And uh, you can see you have social media templates, but we're going to hit more. And you can see right here is a Pinterest graphic. So we're going to click that to get going. And, and again, Canva is free. It does have some paid things like you'll see these templates here are all done for you. You just need to, you know, it's going to load up the design and you can fill in your message. You can add text to it. You can change background. You can upload your own images. They even have some premium uh, things like this one is going to cost you maybe a buck or two. But for the most part, everything here, a lot of the things on here are free. Uh, we're going to go ahead and just, we're not even, not even going to use the templates, the background the layout templates. I'm just going to do something really simple. I'm just going to pick a color. And for this purpose, I'm going to pick something purple because my colors of my business are purple. And then I'm going to upload an image. And I'm going to upload my own image and I'm going to go grab this. goes. I'm just going to drag it over here. And you can see it's obviously me in a cape. Now I can make it a little bit bigger. I can make it go off the page if I want to bleed it over to the edge. Maybe I will do that. Maybe I'll get my logo in there. Make it a little smaller. There we go. Now I'm going to go over to text here and I'm just going to put in whatever text I want to put in. And I can put in just simple headlines if I'd like. Or I can put something a little more fancy. Like this here. Think of something fun to say. Put in my logo down here. Tilt it a little bit here. There we go. Maybe I'll make myself Nuclear Chowder Marketing Man. A little crest. Um, so I would I would suggest get out there and experiment with it. I'll put in my website here, nuclearchowder.com. So now I got a pretty cool image. I can go ahead and download this. I'm going to save it to a high quality image. And super easy, super fast to do. You don't need to be a graphic designer. Um, and again, I did this without having to pay a dime for it. So replace that. No reason not to do this now. Just go to Pinterest and upload it. And you can see it's it's formatted for Pinterest. It's perfectly formatted for Pinterest. So get out there, get to Canva, and start experimenting with things. Create some images. Have some fun. And uh, utilize that powerful tool that is Pinterest. 
All right, now you're ready to go create your Pinterest images. And I'm sure if you're playing around with Canva, you can see you can create any kind of images. It's all about the, getting the size right on social media. Pinterest needs uh, tall images. So uh, on Facebook, the images are gonna be different and you can use Canva for any of these things. But make sure you're using Pinterest uh, for any business. Tell your story, have some fun. And that's what I did in that image and in this video. And uh, go out there and give it a try. I'll see you on the next video.